Hey guys, welcome back to No Catchy Name. It's me, Ella, and today I wanted to share with you some Happy Mail. <laughs> I got kind of uh, a lot of it, and I haven't had time to show it, so I wanted to hop on here and show it now. Also, I have to run and get my laptop in a minute because I forgot to do that. Anyways, let's see here. I know I showed that one. I showed that one, I think. I can't remember. Okay, cards first. <laughs> so this is a postcard that I got from Barbara. I cannot remember if I showed this. I may have already showed this, but I will. I'll show it again. <laughs> so here's the postcard from Barbara. I got this in the end of August, so I'm pretty sure I've showed this. It was just in my stack, and I, my mother just forgot to put it up. <laughs> and then, thank you, Barbara. I got this card. When did this one come? It says September 20, 2021, so it's recently. I got this one just recently from Cheryl, and it's just like a, whoop, like a, you know, like a regular card. What's it called? Like a just checking in kind of card. <laughs> Whatever. So thank you, Cheryl, for that. Just stick it on the back of it. <laughs> And then I got this one. Was this also? Yeah, this says September 4th. 4th. And this is a, um, a baby-related card <laughs> from Natalie's Closet. So here it is. It's glittery. It's really cute. And it's got like, it's like, you know, it's layered. <laughs> I don't know what that's called. But yes, so thank you for that. It also has um, stickers on the back of it and on the front of it. <laughs> little stickers okay so those are the cards that I got and then I got a pack two packages one's a baby gift and one is a it was fabric so I'll show you the baby gift first this gift is awesome I about cried when I opened it in the box I'm not gonna spill stuff everywhere to get it all out okay. okay so here's the card that it came with it's a really cute baby card. I hope you can see it. It's real glary. <laughs> really cute like baby card. And it says a little baby girl. <laughs> Such a cute card. This is from Diana. Oh, I'm still a little congested. Like my ears are stuffed up. <laughs> this is such an amazing baby gift. I absolutely love it. Me and Devin was both like freaking out over it. It's so cute. So I'll show you. There's two hats and a cute little sweater. Now that I'm showing them to you, I can put them up. So here's one of the hats. These are knitted also as well. Knitted. So it's so cute. And it's that kind of yarn. It's got different, like, textured yarns. I, I forget what this is called. That comes with these little things. These yarn balls. I've had some before. I can't remember now what they're called. But they're the little balls of yarn to make hats with that come with little animals to put on top. And it is removable for, you know, washing. So it's such a cute little knitted hat with a little mouse on it. And then another one with a butterfly. It's so cute. Now these are good because these look like these are going to be for her. Like when she's a year old. These are bigger hats for when she's got a bigger head. So that's cool. So I already have some like pre in advance. And then this sweater. This is a knitted sweater. Oh my god. Isn't it so beautiful? Whoops, my alarm went off <laughs> to take my shot. <laughs> but anyways, here's this beautiful sweater. I cannot get all this sweater. It's so detailed and beautiful. And again, it's a larger size, so it'll be good for her when she's older. Look at all the... It's got cabling on it. And uh, little, like, bobble stitches. I don't know what it's called, a knit <laughs> on it. And it's got a little hood. It's got these cute toggle buttons. And then the back of it has cables on it, too. It is so beautiful. This looks like it would be for her when she's bigger again, like I said. And it's just so beautiful. I have to, I have to remember <laughs> when I put her, her in this to take pictures because it's going to be so cute. Oh my gosh. Me and Devin was both like, oh my god. Because <laughs> like, knitted things are so, like I, I'm not putting down crochet at all because I'm a crocheter. But knitted always seems like it's more harder, but it's because I don't knit. <laughs> so it's like crazy to me that someone just made this cute little sweater. And it's so detailed and pretty I can't wait to see her in it but I've got to put these in some sort of bag that'll keep them safe between now and when she's big enough to wear them and I need to put something down in there so that no bugs will get on them you know moths I don't know moth balls I guess I don't know that is so beautiful so thank you so much for those we, we both love them <laughs> all right so next I'm going to show you a box of fabric that I got gifted to me and then I do have some more baby gifts but I don't have them here 
they're still at my sister's because when they came she was still her her and her family had covid they've recovered now but um that was a couple weeks ago when they came and you know i didn't want to go over there because i had covid and then when they they got off their um quarantine the beginning of september somewhere around there <laughs> around labor day a little after labor day but then that's when Devin and me got sick from jesse's ear infection and stuff and we didn't have COVID, thankfully. We had two negative tests. <laughs> so we had to get tested twice to make sure. But um, we had to, we just had something else, some kind of cold or something. So then we were recovering, and we're still kind of recovering from that. So we just haven't went, you know, we, we didn't want to exchange germs. <laughs> so they're still at her house, and I will go get them whenever. We all get better. <laughs> but anyways, this is, uh, this first package I'm going to show you is uh, fabric gifts from the mystery person who sends me fabric, which I appreciate a whole lot because <laughs> it helps a ton. So, um, I already got some pulled out because this is actually going to be the next shop update. Some of this is fabric I already had. I need to set it aside. But, um, I'll show you what's still in the box and then go from there. There's also a crochet hook. I'll show it to you real quick. So, this is a uh, 4.5 uh, millimeter hook. I think this is a tulip. I'm not exactly sure. It looks like them, but I don't know. I don't have any. <laughs> but there's this hook, which now I can put up now that I'm showing you. And then they also sent a bobbin. It was wrapped in plastic, <laughs> but I opened it so I could measure it. Um, uh, this this is called cotton webbing. This is what I use for handles on my tote bags and on my zipper bags and stuff like that. So um, and it has 11 yards on it. I measured it. <laughs> Always right on the bobbin. But uh, so it's really pretty. Cream color with red. They are pretty on bags. And then fabric. Um, big old piece of this. This feels like a few yards. Really cute dinosaur print. Super cute. And then there was two prints that I thought would be cute for me to make Jesse something with and June something with. So this is the one for Jesse because it's a dinosaur print also, but it's like a realistic looking dinosaur print. I don't know what I'm going to make yet though. This is like a yard, so I'll have to figure out something cute to make him. And then for June, there's this Disney princess print. So I thought it would be cute to make them something. <laughs> I just don't know why yet. <laughs> and then there was a Christmassy print. She's really pretty. I love Christmas. Such pretty. These are these look like um what are they called? The centerpieces? Like people put in their around Christmas, you know, you put like a table runner and then some of these and then candles. It just looks pretty. <laughs> That's what it looks like to me. Really pretty. And then there was also some just solid red fabric, which is great for uh liners. And then there was this horse print, which is pretty. This one's one I already had. There was this Minnie Mouse print, which is always cute. Minnie, Minnie and Mickey's always cute. <laughs> this print I already had. And then there was this pretty print. It's glittery and got like uh, swirly looking things on it. <laughs> I'm not going to describe it stuff. And then there were two fat quarters of this cute unicorn print. I already unrolled them. Because like I said, these are the bags I'm going to be, I mean the fabric that I'm going to be using in my next shop update. And then there was some of this fabric. I've had this one before got sloths on it super cute and then there's some really cute um two fall prints which is perfect because I was gonna go shopping for fall prints anyways get that time of year <laughs> this one's got dogs on it and crows that's so cute <laughs> and then this one this one's always popular uh prints like this because people love these old trucks and barns this is a really pretty fall print some of these are pretty big pieces too. They're bigger than the yard. And this piece is so cute. This is like two yards of a gnome school print. And I thought that was so stinking cute. I'm going to make bags out of this and it'd be cute for people who are teachers or no teachers or were teachers. Isn't that the cutest little print ever? Look at their hats. They look like crowns. <laughs> and that one looks like glue. That is such a cute print. I love them little gnomes. And look at this lunch one. He's got a strawberry hat. That is so cute. I love that print. So that was all from that person. These are fabrics I'm going to be using for my next shop update. This Christmas one I'm going to put in my Christmas fabric stash. Which is slowly getting big. <laughs> from people gifting me stuff. And then me also, I had some left over from last year. Um, so to make Christmas bags. Which I love. I'm looking forward to. But yeah, so that's that. So now I'm going to run get my laptop so I can talk about the baby gifts that I got sent to me at my sister's <laughs> and um 
you know, thank people for that. And I'll be right back and wrap that. Okay, I got my laptop. <laughs> I, uh, I got a list on here of all the gifts that people sent me for baby. Because I want to send thank you cards to them. And uh, I'm just having a really hard time finding any thank you cards that have to do with baby themed things, you know. Like after a baby shower you would send. can't find any of those. <laughs> so I might just have to send regular thank you cards. Anyways, okay. So these are the gifts that came since the last time I updated on my baby registry uh, gifts that I received. <laughs> so one was from Ronell and she contributed to the diaper fund, which is awesome. Uh, I think there's $50 in there now, so that's cool. Uh, it's on my Amazon wish list. You can contribute money to it for me and Devin to buy diapers with when she's born. But I have to wait till she's born to see, you know, she's sensitive or anything. Jesse wasn't. He could use pretty much any diapers, so we used all kinds. Because at our baby shower, we got, you know, people buy all kinds of diapers. We went through all of them. And then we just stuck to the Walmart brand after that. But anyways, that's a side track. <laughs> Next was from Tina. And I'm just saying first names because a lot of people don't want other people to know who they are. So that's respectful. She, I'll pop up a picture. I'll move over. <laughs> they, uh, she purchased the swing slash rocker thing <laughs> from my Amazon wish list. My, my alarm went off again. I must have snoozed it instead of canceling it. Anyways, uh, when, when I got that purchase, it, um, it shocked me, Devin, because I didn't really think anyone would buy the bigger gifts that wasn't family. <laughs> so, um, I was super surprised that someone, you know, cares enough about me and my family to purchase a more expensive gift for us. <laughs> but I'm super excited about it because Jesse, when he was a little baby, he absolutely loved his swing rocker thing. I don't know what that's called. <laughs> so much. And it helped so much when he was little, you know, be able to put him in that while I did things. So um, hopefully June will like it too. <laughs> but thank you so much for that. Uh, we are super excited. And it is already at my sister's house. She's got it in her storage shed because... I don't know where I'm going to put it here. <laughs> She's probably going to keep it in her house until the baby's born. So that, um, you know, it's not just in the way until it needs to be in the way. <laughs> All right. And that was the knitted sweaters. I didn't show that. And then recently, I think yesterday, my sister got a package. She messaged me. And it was from Linda. And it was a, I'll pop it up here. It was a, what is it called? Fisher Price Baby Gym <laughs> that was purchased from my registry again. So thank you so much, Linda, for that. I'm super excited about that. Jesse had something kind of similar to that when he was a baby, and it was always just so cute to watch him, you know, kicking his little legs and hitting the buttons and stuff. And there was another one. Oh, yeah, I did mention this one the other day, but I didn't show pictures of it, so I'll go ahead and pop up pictures now so you guys can see it, if you're interested. If you're not, that's okay. This is from someone who did tell me not to send an M at all, so I'm going to send an M at all. But they did purchase bottles, a bottle brush, and a bottle drying rack from my registry. And I'll pop those pictures up so you can see them. I did mention that the other day, but I didn't show pictures of it because I just didn't think to, I guess. But, um, yeah. So now I'm caught up on these gifts so I can move that section. I'm trying to make sure I thank everybody. <laughs> so thank you all so much for any of the baby gifts. I absolutely just love these this little sweater. I cannot wait to see her in this little sweater. <laughs> it's such a sweet thing. And uh, I'm assuming she's going to have dark hair because we all have dark hair. So it's going to look so good with this cream color. Just, I can't wait. <laughs> but thank everybody so much for sending anything, baby gifts or just regular Ella gifts. <laughs> it's always appreciated. And cards. I love cards too. And uh, my little, um, what are they called? Postcards that I get every now and then from Barbara. And I get some from other people too. And it's just a lot of fun to get happy mail. I didn't know that people was thinking about you, you know. So um, I do appreciate it all. But yes, I'm going to go ahead and hop off here and try to get this edited. I got a bunch of bags right here. That's going to be going in the shop this weekend. The only thing I have left to do is run to the drawstrings into the drawstring bags. Um, let's see here. There's going to be six zipper project bags. And then there's going to be, I believe, 17 drawstring bag sets with matching zipper pouches. I think. I'm not sure on the numbers. But they're almost done. So all I got to do is put the drawstrings in there and take pictures and all that stuff. And they'll be good to go. And I also got little strings <laughs> that I got to pick off of them. And uh, do my last little quality check that I always do. I check the seams and stuff. Make sure that they're sewn good <laughs> and all that stuff. But anyways, I'm going to hop off here and get this edited. And if you were to be interested in my baby registry, it's linked in the description of my videos in the Happy Mail section. <laughs> um, but there's no pressure at all. So, uh, yeah, I guess that's everything. I'm going to hop off here, get this done, and then i got to go clean Jesse's bedroom because it is a mess. 
the house has been slacking since we've been sick and I'm trying to catch up. I've been doing a lot of cleaning and organizing and um, I gotta get back at it. Did so much laundry yesterday I thought I was gonna die, but I survived. <laughs> Anyways, for real, I'm gonna hop off now and I'll see you guys in another video. Bye guys.